Hey guys, um, I've had a lot of questions and requests about my bangs. A lot of the questions were, do you cut your bangs yourself or do you get them done at the salon or, or like how do you cut them and stuff like that. Um, yeah, I've only just started cutting my bangs this way. I learned it from another video um, from A. Hen Barbie. She has an excellent side swept bangs video, except that uh, she uses a razor comb, but those are really expensive, so I just use scissors. Um, I know there's a lot of people say like, oh, don't use scissors because it damages your bangs, but it's the only way I can do it, so I don't mind. And these are actually, I think they're actually hair cutting scissors. Um, I got it in that like kit because I cut my brother's hair, so it kind of came like the razor. So um, I guess if not, just use normal scissors, but not like the big kitchen scissors. Usually like those craft scissors, so they're kind of small. I used that before. So um, I'm kind of nervous about doing this on video because, uh, excuse me, um, this is only like my third, fourth time cutting my bangs, so I'm kind of afraid I'm going to mess up and because I'm like in front of camera of anything. But anyways, um, so yeah, the reason why I don't get it done at the salon anymore because um, it's just really expensive to book an appointment, get a... Uh, like a five dollar, five dollar cut done. I don't, I don't know. I'd rather do it myself. So first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna have a plastic bag or something like that, and you're gonna line it on top of your sink. Cause cut it over your sink, so you don't get hair everywhere. And you don't want to do it directly in the sink, cause you don't want to put hair down your drain. So make sure you. So I just line this Walmart bag in here. So when I cut my hair, all the hair will fall in here. I just scoop it up and throw it in the garbage. And I also placed this mirror right here. It's the double-sided one, and this is a more magnified side. So if I can't see it properly or something like that, so. Okay, so, oh wait, sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna take out my bag because I forgot, I forgot I have to wet my bangs. So my bangs are clipped up right now. And I'm, I have lots of hairspray in it, so I'm gonna comb it, comb it through. And you're gonna separate all of your bangs Okay, so this is pretty much it, I think. Yeah. Okay. As you see, they're like really, really thick, and they're actually too long now. So you're going to separate that. Remember, try to get everything. You don't want to miss any parts. And it's going to be down like there, like that. And take out, if, if parts that aren't part of your bangs are sticking there too, remember to pull them out or you might accidentally cut them. So usually I clip back my hair, but I can't seem to find any of my clips right now, so I'm just tying it in a ponytail. Keep all the hair out so I don't accidentally cut anything else. Like that. And I'm just going to wet my bangs a bit. Actually, no, sorry, I did the wrong thing. My bad. Hold on. Okay, here I have a comb and like my kitchen cup, I'm not sorry, my bathroom cup. Okay, so I filled my kitchen cup up with water and I'm going, I kind of filled it up all the way. Ooh, sorry, because I'm going to dip my comb in there. So I'm just going to put it in there first. I'm going to line up my sink with a plastic bag. And now I'm going to just comb through that. It gets it wet, but not too wet. I'm going under too. And this, it's good to have a comb so you can separate everything nicely. Well, you need your hair wet because, you know, that pretty much shows that it's straight down, kind of. Okay, see, there's some parts of my hair that I divided into my bangs that aren't supposed to be there, so I'm going to fix that. Yeah, this can be a very long and boring process. God, look at the grudge grow right now. Okay. Pretty sure I got it. Okay, that's good. Um, the shape that it's supposed to be, it's supposed to go kind of like a triangle. Like, it's like that. It's supposed to be shorter in the middle and then going out slantwards. So pretty much like that. She kind of like that. So you want the middle part to be about right here, to touch right here. Don't go further than that or your bangs will be too short. 
So the way I do it is I comb out the front. I take the middle part, which is about here. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm telling you, this will take a very long time. Because <laughs> I'm like, I don't want to mess up. <laughs> so it'll be this section right here, and you're going to trim it. And remember, when you're trimming, don't go like that. You gotta go horizontally. I kind of go a bit slanted to cut it faster, and you just keep on snipping. And just cut it bit by bit. Like, don't, like, hack it off. <laughs> and you see I'm holding my finger up to kind of border it, so I don't cut it off too much. And I'm missing my sink right now. Okay. So okay, so I'll cut it. Oops. And you see, it's still not long enough, so you gotta do it very bit by bit. So I'll just keep on snipping like that. while it's getting all over my sink. Okay, just keep on snipping till you get to that point and I'll show you what that looks like. Uh, anyways, <laughs> okay, I'm back and you see it's like right up there. Um, I'm kind of, I don't even know, I don't even remember if that's that, like, if that's short enough, but if anything, I'm just going to go back and do it again. So next, you're going to work on these two sides and you're going to make them slanted. So I'm going to work on this side first. Oh, these parts are the sides that I kind of leave, like, the long, oops. Oh, I keep on burping. I'm so sorry. Okay, so those are the sides that you kind of leave long, so I'm kind of leaving them back there. Okay, so I'm going to...